fast detox diets, Billy. They're more popular than ever thanks to celebs like Demi Moore, Salma Hayek. They boast about their cleansing success stories, and you're doing one of these, aren't you, Billy? I did it uh, a couple weeks ago. I did the, did the uh, veggie soups and the and the juice. And I'm he about passed out. <laughs> trying to trying to narrow yeah, it down. I heard you were a little dizzy. Well. I was a little dizzy on too much flaxseed. That stuff's crazy. Anyway, nutritionist <laughs> and author of the O2 Diet, Carrie Glassman, joins us to discuss whether this latest wellness craze is healthy or not. All right, how does this work? Let's jump into the cleanses, the different kinds. Wait, first, are they good or are they bad? Because I always hear about cleanses, and I just need to know, like, is this something we should or should not be doing? Okay, well, first of all, cleanse is really just a very general term. I mean, for me, it's taking out chocolate. For Kate Walsh, apparently, it would be no chips. It's really a general term. Most people these days think of cleansing as juices and or raw food and really it can be a good thing if you use it to kick start a healthier lifestyle okay we've got cooler cleanse here all organic again similar to the others we've got the greens the juices where they also have coconut water in here and a nut milk and I like that they tell you exactly what to do this one first this one second they yeah. make it real easy again it's organic they also have a raw food option here if you need to chew I need to chew <laughs> I can't just do the, this part of it I really need to eat like most of us do so again if you want to kick start a healthier lifestyle not a bad option but don't do it just for quick fix weight loss and go back to the burgers and fries Glassman you're unbelievable <laughs> Very nice to meet